by where a couple swept away. We're at the, the premier beachfront veranda suite. This is the best room in the house. It's a great room for an anniversary, a honeymoon. You want the total beach life. It's got this huge veranda balcony. Lounger, two rocking chairs. Well, they're not rocking, they're still but the loungers are rock. No, this one's aren't. But sit there, Amanda. Show them the view. Now we are in an overcast day, but right here is the famous Seven Mile Beach. And remember, the phone isn't showing you how good the view really is. What the eye captures, the phone can't match. The video camera can't match. And here is your wet bar. There's coffee inside here. So in the morning, you come out front. Look at the beautiful ocean, and today it's not sunny, so it's just gonna be spectacular. And you got your wet bar, your mini bars in there, and your coffee. And that's stocked every day to your preference sheet that will make sure you know how to, to fill out. There's ceiling fans. Then we're gonna go inside the suite. These have the different floors, the lighter tile up. Travertine, I believe. So you see this room has the louvers, it's the beach island vibe right into the suite. It's spacious, a huge king bed, like showcase there. No TV in these premier rooms. There is Wi Fi all over, so you can use your laptop, uh, your iPad, all that stuff, tablets. Um, it's got everything. Every room is similar except for the floors, except for size. It's all about size and location. This property, once again, is on 17 acres. Play space, big, big, beautiful bathroom, tile, quartz countertop, walk-in shower. Is that what have on? And right there, you're showering, and right there's a beach. Look out there. There's uh, the sand, and right there, there's the water. And like I said, when it's sunny out, you get a better view, and your eyes will speak it up. But this is the best room on the property of Couples Resort. We, we book this a lot to our honeymooners and, and anniversary people because it is the ultimate in beach life. You relax, right beach right. You're living for the time you're here in a beach house. Legitimate. How many of us get to live on a beach? I've been to many resorts, and not many resorts offer a room that you step onto the beach. This is one of the resorts that does. A lot of the ones that do offer that are not all inclusive. They're going to be European plan. They're going to be very expensive. So once again, Sean Amanda, Cave of Travel, and uh, we'll get you into one of these premier beachfront suites or whatever fits your budget and what you guys want. If you can't live without a TV, then you can't be in this room. But there are rooms with TVs. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Make sure you use a travel agent. When you book direct with these resorts, you never know what you're gonna get. They don't have, they're hard to get a hold of and get your questions answered. They also, there's a chance of getting downgraded because they're looking out for themselves. When you book online with the online companies, you never know what you're getting. You're all totally on your own. There's nobody that's gonna know anything about what you're talking about. And once again, be always up for downgrade when you book on there. With us, we're a top travel agency. We're top 25 out of over 5,000 privately owned travel agency. We know what we're talking about. We're successful for a reason. We actually spend money and travel. We know the management. We'll make sure your special occasion, vacation, whatever is taken care of perfectly. Thank you, Sean, Amanda, 610-334-1917. That's uh, the caves. And inside there you have Twilight Dinner. It's Twilight Dining. So this is the cave, this is the famous restaurant, there's a restaurant in the caves, you go in the cave, you dive in the cave.
taking a boat ride up the west end of the grill, the beach ends, and then the west end begins. There's a little castle. Here's the caves below. Fishies, the guffs, the Here's the kitties, the birds, some bats. Oh, there's a bat up there. I might be the camera doesn't pick up a guy picks up. Look at him. He's wondering why we're bothering him. 